first, from the first people to climb the Matterhorn. Died, so we've got Lord Douglas there. We have Haddo there. He's the one who fell and dragged the others down with him. It's not his fault, though. Sorry, Haddo. And um, Charles Hudson. And uh, we've got also got Crow. And then we've got Peter Childvarda here who died a little later on. Yeah. And, um, After paying my respects, I further went on to explore the wonderful city up there by the of Zermatt. Monte Rosa Hotel. Anyway, I'll see you for five, six again soon. And I pay my respects to you. All these graves to do with the Matterhorn. <sighs> Bird. Fun fact, between 1865 and 2018, over 600 deaths occurred on the Matterhorn. That is quite a lot. I don't know where the Matterhorn is. Cloudy day today, but um, yeah, we see tomorrow when it's more clear. Just walked up closer to the Matterhorn, but then it was clouded over, and now we're in a pub. We are now in the Matterhorn Museum. I went to the museum and saw the original rope, as well as some other artifacts collected from the dead. All this crystal. Sorry, my phone died. Anyway, after we went into the museum, we went um, and explored Zermatt a little more. I even got the Swiss flag down there. And yeah, and now I'm just at my power charge station because it's only on 2% right now. Anyway, yeah, I'll see you in a minute when it's more charged. Good morning. <sighs> <sighs> Good morning. That's a home now. How big it is. Oh my gosh. It looks so much better in real life. There it is. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. 
Nächster Halt. Next Stop, Riechelberg. Now we got that away again. Thing is absolutely massive. See the beauty in this video, but I can't see how beautiful this is on the camera. But if you think you're wasting your money on holidays like this, just say on a sunny day, it'll make all the difference. This is the best holiday you can get. How sunny it is and how lovely it is. I'm trying not to get my feet burnt, but you can't see the beauty through. Uh, through a device, but with your actual eyes, it looks so beautiful. You can't, I can't explain it. I'm trying not my best not to slip because I'm truly an honour to be somewhere as beautiful as you can't catch the beauty the camera, can you? Watch her. Just disappearing. I'm just gonna put my shades down. Uh, with shades or without shades? I'm gonna show you how deep my stick goes in. Look how deep that is. It's definitely the main part of. Uh, this video so far. You don't know how beautiful this is unless you've been here before. You, you can't see all the details through a camera, which is a shame. I wish you could just see how beautiful this is. But I'll just, oh jeez. This is like quicksand. I'll tell you what, throw that. I'm gonna make a, wait, I'm, I can draw something. I'm gonna draw something. Oh, that didn't work out. Let's draw the matter on. And, uh, right. Hang on. I might draw another side of it. Accident tap. Jesus. Don't know how steep this is. Closer to the edge than this. It's so much bigger than it looks. I just wish you, you guys could see the rescue helicopters. Wait, oh my god! Can you see that? Don't think you can, but someone just fell down. I don't think you can see it, my camera's really bad quality. But someone fell down the face. That, that one right there. Right there. Like I said earlier, 600 deaths in the meeting, we make that 600 million. I hope we're okay, but I don't think you could have seen it because uh, you. My camera can't, isn't that, doesn't do that well in weather like this. 
yeah, that's pretty much all I got. I am currently 4,000 meters above sea level. Definitely feel the oxygen. It's thinner up here. Jeez. If you can see Zermatt down there, you know there's like little cliffs down there. I don't think you can see because of the clouds, but um, those look. We can even fit them in the above you. And look how much taller it gets. <sighs> Such an exotic area. You can't catch all the stuff in in this video but um, this is so beautiful I could just I could oh no I need a house right here so there's snow how is there tons so much snow here if we're above the clouds <laughs> this time right now I go maybe for about a couple of thousand feet down there. Sounds like the rescue hull of helicopters are finally coming in. I don't think they're alive anymore after falling off that. Anyway, um, that is quite disturbing. Anyway, if I roll down there, I fall for a couple of thousand feet and then splatter. And I, I don't have crampons. That's the rescue helicopter. Why are you coming over our scene? It's over there. Jesus, God, that's loud. There's one loud. Crampons for this. So if I slip, if I don't hold on to something, I'm dead. I fall now. I'm dead. Simple as that. I can't go any further than this, I'm afraid. By the way, here's a quick reminder of how steep it is. Try my best not to die going down. It's the most scariest thing I've ever experienced in my life. I've got to get my foot in. If I fall here, I'm dead. It's that simple. Roll a couple of thousand feet, fall, and I'm dead. Jesus Christ! That is some deep snow. Like I said, extra caution is needed. We fall a minute ago. Just think how easy that is to die up there. My first episode, I was calling Haddo an idiot. I don't feel that anymore. Really dangerous things. Really dangerous place. But yeah, so beautiful. I'm gonna try and get to this small peak here. Show you a better view of the matter one, hopefully. I hope, I hope that guy's okay. Looks like there's been an avalanche. Maybe that's what happened. Really at the summit. Think about. <sighs> Didn't get much of a better view. You know, descend now. <sighs> Didn't get much of a better view, did I?
Oh, my leg. Leg. Stop. Alright, I'm going. Let's go back down. Footsteps. Too little breath. My lips frozen up here. to finally strong. You can kind of see where I fell from. All the way up there. Luckily I didn't hit the rocks. So unluckily I wasn't recording while this happened, so I'm just going to have to do it in my classical presentation. Okay, let's start. So, I was climbing up there. It's quite, it was quite big. I was climbing up, got the way about there, someone shouted something and it scared me and I slipped and fell all the way down there and that is probably at least 25 feet luckily I wasn't hurt my ribs hurt though that's the only thing I started rolling about there oh, my ribs hurt. 